It's January 9, 2019. Another beautiful day at Continuous Harvest Farms. Been uh, doing a nine day cycle and uh, especially the uh, sunflowers in the winter time. In the past I've needed uh, even up to 12 days, but I'm trying to push it to nine using heaters. This harvest is, um, it's okay, it's not that great. I mean, I'm just looking at it here. But uh, better than the last one. These were germinated in um, temperatures of about 71 Fahrenheit. And um, since then I've increased that temperature. So when I uh, unstack the next batch, we'll get to see if that helped uh, with germination. So now let's see if this batch has uh, done it better with a higher heat. I think these are at about 81 Fahrenheit. So the radish are very happy at this temperature and watering system. The uh, uh, broccoli, no these are, uh, shoot I can't remember, these are different brassica. They seem quite happy. So it worked for those two, but if you look here, um, not real good in the center. I think it got overheated. But on, on the outside, it's pretty good. But I can see a spot in the center that's not good. So I'm going to have to back off on the temperature a little bit. Um, I do think I'm going in the right direction, but still not, uh, not a good answer here. So my harvest was 370 grams, which was up from 279 last week. And the major change was I love or I uh, reduced the height of the water overflow valve, uh, so less water was getting in. I started uh, the heaters, but that was halfway through this grow, and the heater impacts germination, so that did not have a big impact here. So I think these uh, sunflowers here have been affected by too much heat and I will lower the heat level for the next batch. Here's a picture of my harvest. It needs to be mixed up a little bit. So here's my harvest. Just about, uh, just under 90 grams per jug there and uh, for a total of 370 grams working towards my goal of 500 grams harvest and five tubs of uh, 100 grams each thank you for watching